Hi Scorpio, welcome to my channel. This is Chelsea. Thank you so much for liking and subscribing. I really appreciate your love and support and I hope all is well with everyone. Today we are going to find out what are the important love messages for you. Please bear in mind that this is a general reading and it may not apply to each and every one of you. Okay Scorpio, spirits and angels, please show me important accurate love messages for Scorpio today. Show me more. For those of you who have children, Scorpio, good news in regards to your children or your child here. That's a side note, uh, Scorpio side message for those of you who need to hear it. Uh, we've got the Queen of Cups here, Scorpio, that's actually your energy, right? However, who knows your person possibly has the same energy as well. For those of you who are single, Scorpio, it just looks like there could be, again, some sort of passionate communication coming in that's going to make you really, really happy. This can be somebody either a little bit older than you are or a little bit younger than you are. Feels like this is someone, perhaps, um, you you find this person quite interesting, okay? Cute, interesting, definitely that's what I'm getting here. Or someone very different from what you would usually go for or what you would expect. But it definitely, it, it's like a breath of fresh air. I definitely see that, especially if you are ne a single, okay, Scorpio? This part of the message for those of you who are single. However, we've got the Queen of Cups and the Page of Swords here. Someone could be checking up on you. Um, it could be someone from your past or somebody new. But definitely somebody is interested to find out more about you. If this is someone new, they could be scrolling down your Facebook or your Instagram or you know, could be searching on, uh, searching, searching you on Google, things like that. I do sense uh, someone is very, very interested in getting to know you better, who you are as a person. But first and foremost, I feel like with the swords, you know, swords indicate some sort of information. So most likely, it's them uh, checking up on you on your, uh, on the internet. Okay. Um, unless they can do a background check with your social security number, but <laughs> anyway, um, that's a little bit, that, that's like a little bit too much, right? Going too far, but, um, anyway, Scorpio, for those of you with a page of pentacles here in reverse, eight of pentacles in reverse, that's an energy of somebody wondering also, again, this could be you or the other person. Somebody here would like to send you a message, right? Wanting to reach out, page is a messenger. However just at the same time in the meantime just keeping tabs on you this is possibly somebody you are doing doing your best not to focus on not to concentrate on um but this and another thing that i'm getting if somebody is ignoring you and not paying attention to you uh it does look like actually they do they still are interested because page of swords is here you won't spawn somebody unless you are kind of interested to know what they're up to but uh we've got the hermit here in reverse six of pentacles here in reverse spirit saying scorpio if you are single or if you've been you know, if you're broken out, whatever the case it could be, it just feels like it's time to come out and play, okay? Hermit, uh, the hermit here in reverse indicates time to come out from your isolation mode, okay? If you've been hiding and just, you know, keeping to yourself, it feels like with the Six of Pentacles here in reverse, not sharing anything because Six of Pentacles can indicate sharing, not sharing anything, not doing anything with people. Uh, the sun is here. Time to come out and play okay time to see the world and see the darkness the hermit is so dark while the sun here is so bright but this could also indicate scorpio that good times are good times are um coming okay for a lot of you perhaps the sun also indicates happiness positivities there's something that's going to make you really really happy someone is going to communicate with you it could be a back and forth communication because it's a very passionate communication perhaps online, perhaps on, on your phone, uh, however you like to communicate with this person. But this could also indicate with the 801 some, some sort of movement, right? Someone could be moving towards you or you could be moving towards them, taking actions um, towards each other. And I feel like for some of you, Scorpio, you may not have met this person yet, okay? I see a few different scenarios here. If you haven't met this person yet um, and you've only been talking online, perhaps you're going to be really happy that finally both of you are possibly going to, you know, plan to meet up, okay? Uh, or for some of you, this is somebody perhaps you already know, you've already met, 
and that both of you have have shown a lot of interest uh, towards each other i feel like the sun here again it's going to make you really really happy it's a very exciting energy that i'm getting here as well this is somebody very fun very exciting always constantly very positive has ha somebody who has a very positive outlook in life in general okay so doesn't matter the rest of these cards here, but I feel like th there's some curiosity here. Like somebody is curious about you. Find, try and find out in regards to uh, who you are as a per person. You got a stalker here, Scorpio, but it's not a bad stalker. I don't see it as like a creepy stalker or anything like that. Oh, Scorpio, it could be you stalking somebody, spying on somebody whom you may be interested in, okay? Again, it can be reversed when both of you could be spying on each other. I guess this is a very common thing, right, Scorpio? Like, uh, I mean, these days. When you start to get to know somebody, you just go on online and check out their Facebook and scroll all the way towards the end. But anyway, I do see that scenario here for some of you, okay? And we've got the Ten of Cups in reverse and the Ace of Wands. This indicates a new beginning, okay? A new beginning, or it could be an, a reignited passion with somebody from your past, okay? I know for those of you, Scorpio, if you're not interested in somebody from your past at all, then, you know, you can... You, you can just don't don't listen to that part okay because it's like for me i believe in manifestation as well if you don't don't want somebody from your past just ignore that part about whenever if i talk about somebody from your past but scorpio aces indicates a new beginning so a new beginning can start with somebody new but also it can start with somebody from your past returning right so because ten of cups here is in reverse so this may indicate some sort of a separation or trouble in paradise for those of you scorpio if you are going through some issues with your person right now perhaps the issues will be put behind because ace of wands is here let's start over okay let's start over that's definitely what i'm getting here and passion is being reignited okay both of you are gonna feel good about each other however for some of you ten of cups in reverse again can indicate a separation if you're separated from somebody here ace of wands definitely indicates that uh, it can be reignited. Somebody is in interested in reigniting this passion or to reconcile, get back together. However, majority of you, Scorpio, if you are if you are single, I definitely see this new new love coming in. Okay, you're gonna find this person again very interesting, and you're gonna ver be very attracted to this person. Okay. This person can be a little bit of an opposite of you, Scorpio. It's like same, same, but different. Hope that makes sense to you. Feels like both of you either may have water sign somewhere in your chart or fire, strong fire as well. And the fire indicates passion, desire, right? So you're going to be very passionate about this person. You desire this person and this person may feel the same way about you as well. And the moon here is in reverse it's like there is no doubt scorpio if there are a few other people that you would like to choose from or vice versa there is no doubt they know like you know that you are the one that they they're interested in you're the one that they want and vice versa or vice versa and we've got the death here for the three of pentacles for those of you if you are interested in somebody from your past it does feel like there could be uh, somebody here trying to revive this connection trying to fix things with you three of pentacles here who knows well all i know scorpio if some of you could be dealing from somebody f dealing with somebody from your past wanting to return or you wanting to return to somebody from your past and then there's also one new person i mean it is not po it is not impossible right so we've got the six of wands here in reverse yeah you see all of these ones the six ones right this card to me indicates admirers having options people just looking up to you or people who are interested in you or it could be you interested in somebody okay but of all these ones here uh and now it's in reverse so it feels like somebody is going to choose pick one one out of the six one with the ace of ones here and you're going to choose one person out of a whole lot <laughs> i feel like there could be many okay well the other person could be choosing you as well uh, amongst the rest all right so we've got the seven of wands here two of pentacles yeah look you're gonna have to make a choice right two of pentacles you're gonna have to make a choice between you know one person i don't know few person two person how however many but with the seven of wands here and the two of cups 
Interesting. I feel like Scorpio Spirit is definitely saying that to stand your ground, make sure you have your principles, make sure whoever this new person is uh, does not cross it. But also for some of you, this is somebody, if this is somebody from your past, Spirit is also saying to, you know, make sure this person doesn't cross your boundaries and that, you know, stay who you are who you uh, stay who you are as your person whatever that you expect in a partner you should not have to um how do you say you should not have to settle okay for anything less than what you think you deserve i mean the two of cups here of course scorpio look that's definitely a, there is a new relationship coming in for you guys scorpio some of you it could be a successful reconciliation but for some of you this for a lot of you i feel like if you are completely single this is definitely a new love beginning with the world here indicates a closing of an old chapter a new chapter will begin for someone maybe you meet this person while you're traveling or online the world can indicate the world wide web right scorpio this is your reading i hope you resonated if you did please hit like share and subscribe and i'd like to leave you with my latest video on the screen right now for those of you who don't know i do have a second channel it's a travel vlog channel i'm a digital nomad so i travel a lot um and i do film it uh film my travel experiences uh, every now and then but i don't post very often just once a month on that channel because i'm really busy with this one but anyway scorpio i hope to see you tomorrow at your next reading and also i'm open for personal readings if you'd like to book me my information is in the description box below just send me an email and i will reply you with all the necessary information in order to book me for a reading all right take care scorpio hope to see you tomorrow bye